grand rising, grand rising, grand rising people. This is your guy, the inspired seeker. And this rising's message is on the law of attraction. Similar to the law of vibration, guys, this law asserts that we don't attract where we want, but rather where we are, all right? Again, this law asserts that we don't attract what we want, or we don't get what we want, but rather where we are, right? Like attracts likes, okay? Birds of the same feather flocks together. Athletes hang with other athletes. Toxic people hang with other toxic people. All right, like attracts likes, okay? So let's understand that we don't get what we want, but rather what we are, okay? We attract that into our life, all right? When I make these videos and post them out there, guys, I don't go out there and look for subscribers, all right? I just create the videos and get the messages out there and allow the universe to push that to those who need to hear it, all right? And ultimately, these messages attract the subscribers to the channel, all right? So that's essentially, that's like your, my tribe, so to speak, right? The people who resonate with the messages, that's like my tribe. So like attracts likes, all right? I'm not gonna attract narcissists, all right? If a narcissist, appears on my channel, then chances are they're just there to be nosy and be disruptive, all right? Narcissists are not gonna find my channel helpful. The people who find my channel helpful are my tribe, all right? And those are the people that are being attracted. So like attracts likes, all right? This law further states that we need to believe we could get and have what we want, all right? that's the prerequisite okay you have to believe that you can get and have what you want all right if you want a certain amount of money you have to believe that you can have that that amount of money all right you have to believe that you can get that amount of money all right and you have to believe that you can have that amount of money all right and then you devise a plan of how to get that kind of money and then take inspired action to get that kind of money. This means that we have to feel capable, okay? We have to feel capable and deserving of our desires, all right? Again, we have to feel capable and deserving of our desires. As a prerequisite, guys, we have to become the individual who is worthy of our desires, all right? We cannot be sitting here doing absolutely nothing, just wasting our time, wasting our lives away, but expecting to hold a higher position in a certain organization, all right? We have to, what? Become an individual who is worthy of this sad position, all right? If we want to manifest a particular position at a particular firm, then we must first become that individual worthy of that position by first acquiring the necessary credentials for that position, all right? And once we do this now, we can then put ourselves out there to attract the recruiters of that company, okay? Or, or that organization or that firm. All right. So, as I said, we have to become the individual worthy of it. All right. We have to see ourselves capable and deserving of it first. Huh? And then we have to do the things that's necessary. All right. We don't just set out with no credentials and say, I want to be the manager. All right. Being a manager requires a certain level of education. It requires a level, a certain level of experience, all right? So we can't just sit down and say we want to be the manager, right? We have to acquire the necessary education. We have to acquire the necessary experience, all right? These are the credentials I talked about, all right? And once we do this now, we can then make ourselves available, okay? Once 
we do this now we make ourselves available to attract that certain position in this case a managerial position we don't get what we want but rather what we are and like attracts likes so i hope i made it clear enough until next time guys peace love and more life